Breaking news. Abubakar Malami, Attorney General of the Federation, has just released a statement regarding his declaration for the Kirby governorship election, which has gone viral and um, he's released a statement right now that is causing serious reaction as to who is right. Abubakar Malami is one person who has fought down the National Assembly who said um, people who have been appointed should not hold any other political office unless they you know they they um they resign within a particular period of time um the attorney general of the federation went ahead by himself okay and um, got the matter overturned where a judge in um you know in uh, uh, abia asked him to expunge that from the new bill and many, many quarters says it is because the guy himself is eyeing to become the vice, um, to become a governor in his own state, which is Kirby State. And um, this is why he wants things to be in his favor. And um, this is why he's doing what he's doing. Anyway, we heard this morning that he has declared for governorship of which he is now speaking about and giving a contrary opinion as to his declaration. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up like us share subscribe let's get all the details report i have declared for kirby governorship is fake abubakar malami attorney general of the federation and minister of justice dr abubakar malami san has denied the report that he has declared interest to contest the 2023 governorship election in his state kirby state Attorney General of the Federation, Abubakar Malami, has come out with a statement. There have been speculation that Malami is interested in succeeding Governor Atiku Badigo. But on Tuesday morning, some platform reports that the minister has thrown his heart into the ring of the Kirby governorship election. In a statement, Dr. Oman Jubrim, his special assistant on media and publicity relations issued on behalf of Malami, Abubakar Malami, the attorney general, dismissed the report. The clarification became necessary in view of a fabricated publication in some section of the media. He said the declaration to contest for a political position was never a hidden affair or can be hidden from others. The operation that could be reported as a scoop by a section of media. He said the report was targeted, was triggered out of curiosity and eagerness by followers and loyal, loyalists. A video being circulated as the proposed declaration was mischievously translated with fabricated intention and in interpose, which cannot in spirit of contest establish the malinformation circulation. He, however, thanked the team supporters of Malami and the general public for expressing their interest in him going for the position. His media aide said at the appropriate time, they will hear from the horse's mouth in full glimpse of the media stakeholders and like-minded party faithful and supporters. And so people should not be in haste to declare it before he declares it. He's happy for the way the media and everyone has responded that he's going for such a position. He said he's quite happy and at the right time he will make the declaration. So that's the Attorney General of the Federation, Abubakar Malami, who has indicated and said that um, the whole governorship thing is a fake, that he never said he was going for such a position. And that really and sincerely speaking, when it's time, he will, you know, he will uh, uh, open up on what his intentions are with, relate, with regards to, you know, this this matter and that he will let nigerians know he will come out and then um, you know let nigerians know but for him he find it quite interesting that a lot of persons are interested in him being the governor of kirby state okay uh said very soon we will we will we will ensure that um we get we we, we, we he declares that and he will declare it at the right time so this is what is happening Okay, this is what is going on and uh, this is what is happening right now. Well, my wonderful people, it is becoming necessary that um, we, we begin to reevaluate those in position who apparently should be leading and concentrating on what they need to do to ensure safety of lives and property, but rather they are focusing their attention on other things. Okay, they are, they, 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 the focus has been totally different from what it should be. 
Okay. So this is what is happening right now. Abu Bakr Malami, although he wants to contest and he said he will express it at the right time, but he has not said it. And that um, the persons who have said he made that uh, declaration that it was all uh, false, um, you know, for the falsified information, that was never him. So my wonderful people, we are bringing you up to speed in terms of um, all that is going on and want to let you know that um, very soon you will hear from the horse's mouth. Uh, we've been hearing uh, on the media that um, oh he's going for this position, he's going for that position, but apparently he's coming out now to tell Nigerians that it was not him or uh, it was those supporters. They can't wait for him to declare. They've declared it for him that he's quite happy and he will, you know, he will um, he will let the cat out of the bag at the right time. So my people, we, this is it. This is a man, one of the worst attorney general we've gotten in Nigeria, who is cumbersome with all kinds of atrocities and cycled around him. This is the man who, you know, he, he, he doesn't mind what happened. He just says things and, you know, his hands is deep into all kinds of vices, all kinds of things. There is a cover-up. Abu Bakr Malami is there. There's something not right. Abu Bakr Malami is there. And this is the man who wants to be the governor of his state. Okay? So what do you think will happen? What do you think will happen if, if, if he becomes the governor? Okay? What do you think will happen? So these are some of the things going on and everybody needs to be very wary, okay? We're, we're very, very wary of all that is going on right now and everybody needs to, you know, really needs to begin to reevaluate some of these things because um, Malami, being an attorney general, he has so many things, okay, tied to him that one begin to wonder, what kind of a man is this? What sort of a person is this? Yeah. And this is the same person now who, you know, we can see very clearly is the same man. Yeah. Who is now wanting to become a governor. What do you think will happen? Kebi State, I feel for that state, honestly. Honestly, sincerely speaking, I feel for that state. I feel strongly for Kebi State. Not just Kebi State, all over Nigeria. The people who are showing interest. What do you think is happening? What do you think is going on? And why do you think that um, Nigeria will change in a hurry if nothing is done to solve the situations of where we're currently seeing and what, we, what we're experiencing today? You know, it's clear indication to us that um, nothing might change in a hurry if nothing really happened tangible to change the course of everything, you see. So leave us a comment. We would love to hear from you. God bless you. Have a good day. Bye for now.